get myself into. I don't know how to interview virtually. I don't even know where to start. It's starting soon. When are these gonna end? I've only been here for a little bit and I'm super tired. All these conversations are pointless. Blah, blah, blah. Uh, oh, uh, hi, I'm John. Uh, I just graduated. Uh, I, I, I did work uh, with some other jobs. I, I think I'm, I align. Um, uh, yeah. Uh, are you guys hiring right now? What uh, What does your company do? Hi, yes, we are hiring in the environmental sector for a wide range of positions in different departments. Have you had a chance to look over what positions we have listed on our website and exactly what we do? No, I didn't. I just signed up. I saw you were here. Um, I didn't really know I needed to prepare, honestly. Oh, okay, no worries. We're looking for a candidate that has great organization skills and feels comfortable talking to clients and vendors. Do you feel comfortable with those tasks? And why are you interested in this organization? Um, yeah, you know, um, I just need a job right now. Um, I, I, I could do those tasks. Yeah, I, I, could, I could do those tasks. Um, I, I, I had a job in high school where I did some filing, so yeah, I think I'd be a good fit. Can I send you my resume? We actually have access to your resume um, on this platform, so I'll take your name and hand it off to our hiring manager to let them know to contact you. Uh, okay, cool, bye. So what did the candidate do wrong? He had a distracting background, lots of noise going on, he wasn't sitting up straight, and he was using filler words like like or um. He also wasn't prepared for the conversation. He didn't do any research beforehand, he didn't ask any questions, and didn't really show any interest in the company. If he did ask questions, they were very open-ended and quick to the point. He left the conversation very quickly and just said bye without any follow-up conversation for a later date. Now, what did the employer do wrong? He didn't start with a welcoming environment. He just didn't ask how his day was going or didn't explain his role in the organization. He didn't explain the benefits of working at the organization or his personal favorite parts. There was poor facial expressions and he didn't really show any interest in the job or his career himself. When the employer is unprepared and uninterested, it also makes the candidate uninterested and a little bit nervous as well. It takes both parties to make the interview go smoothly and for both people to feel comfortable. Hey, my name is Chase. I'm one of the recruiters here at XYZ. I've been here for almost five years. How's your day going? Tell me a little bit about yourself. Hi Chase, my name's John. Uh, my day's been going great so far. I graduated from UBC uh, with a Bachelor of Science in Environmental Practice. And I noticed on your website that you're hiring for an environmental technician position. And could you tell me a little bit more about the opportunity? For sure, great question. We've been in the environmental sector for almost 15 years now. The role you're speaking on is us trying to help outside organizations be more efficient in renewable energy and waste. Have you had any previous experience with this? Wow, that sounds very interesting. I do have some previous experience with my internship. I was also in charge of the waste logistics and data tracking, which aligns with our needs to reduce uh, our waste. Does your organization have an opportunity for me to grow within the organization and potentially move up within the company? Yes, we actually offer monthly workshops for employees to learn about new practices, including some off-site um, demonstrations so you get some hands-on training. Our company prides itself as growing as an organization together, including a great benefit plan. Wow, that sounds amazing. I really enjoy that your company puts plans in place that allows their employees to grow their skills. Can I leave my resume with you? 
We actually have all participants' resumes downloaded from attending this career fair by Eco Canada. But I will make sure to jot down your name and hand it off to our HR to let them know about your interest in this position. Are you interested in any other positions? That would be amazing. Uh, my full name is John McKenzie and I'll actually drop my name as well as my number in the chat and make sure there's no spelling or any mix-ups. Uh, if your HR team does feel that I'm better suited for any other positions within your company. I just want to let you know that I am open to working in other positions as well. This sounds great. I'm noting this down now and I'll be sure to hand it off to our hiring team and they will be contacted with you right away. Thanks. It was great chatting with you, Chase. Uh, please reach out to me via email or call if you have any questions you need me to follow up on. And can I connect with you on LinkedIn in case I have any follow up questions? For sure. I'll make sure to drop my LinkedIn handle in the chat and we can connect on there. Thanks for your interest. Thank you so much, Chase. I hope to hear from you soon. Now what did the candidate do right? He started off by introducing himself and how his values align with the organization. There was no background noise, he had a clean desk, and was prepared and focused. He knew about the company and did his research beforehand and pinpointed the parts that he was specifically interested in. He also explained how his past experience aligned with this specific job. He showed interest in the company and how he was able to grow and learn while working there. He asked good questions that led to a further conversation where he was able to build a relationship with the interviewer. And what did the employer do right? The employer was welcoming and informed the candidate of how long they've been with the company and their role there. He promoted the organization and the benefits to working there and how you can grow at the company. And he left the candidate feeling good. He said he would pass along the information to HR and sounded positive and uplifting. He told the candidate that they will be in contact no matter what, so they're not left wondering. 